I was born in Mexico, raised in South Central Los Angeles. This the home of the Dodgers. This the home of the Lakers. Shout out to the, the city has had a long bad reputation for violence. It is known for producing a lot of street gangs, but it is also a famous city from films, music, and popular culture. Over the years, the city has improved in some ways. But it still isn't the safest city. Black and Brown is South Central Los Angeles. Without either one, it is in LA. Linwood, Maywood, and Bell Gardens. All my boys indicted. Pray to God you beat them charges. Yeah, regardless, LA. Is I am making this small documentary to give everyone a message. I know it is hard for the black and brown community to come together when you live in a poor community with drugs and gangs involved. Most of the time, we don't have the right guidance and we fall in the wrong hands. I believe and know we can overcome it and unite. We are all what we got. And in order to make a change, you have to start somewhere. Good morning, boys and girls. You over there in that black shirt. What you want to be when you grow up? Uh. My mother worked two jobs, gang banging was too raw 1993 I was bumping some of that Snoop Dogg Murder was the case, my uncle caught a case My grandmother stressing out, I could feel the pain Acting older than I was, I should have been acting my age I had to walk to school, I got recruited to the gang My mother tried to do her best on minimum wage But it was hard when I seen the drug dealers in the range I know it's hard to grow up I know it's hard to grow up I'm right here with my, my homies, Neats, Charlie Wang, and you know, we're right here trying to trying to make things right, you know, we're right here, um, been through a lot, you know, it's a blessing. So I want to talk about like this year, this year's been hard, Kobe Bryant died on us, um, you know, as it hit the world, it, it impacted us a lot. Then we got COVID, COVID just, just hit us nowhere too, like, yeah, and then you got police brutality, I mean, it's police brutality, Brutality has been going on for a long time. Or publicized. Because yeah, because of, of the internet. Exactly. Yeah. This year's been fucked up, you know. And and then you got this whole racial thing, bullshit going on. Like, can't we can't hate each other, man? We gotta like unite. You know, this is the time we gotta it's unite. The same struggle. Yeah, and it's like this is the time for you guys to see, like, damn, look at the shit they be doing. You know what I mean? Like, I want to do that too. I could wake up and do that. You know. You go up in LA. It's not so much about like you being black or being Mexican because Latinos in LA are not only Mexican. You got Salvis, you got Hondureños, you got Guatemala. You Belize, got, you, got you got everything. Belize. I feel like it's just one race. That's the human race. And everybody else, they just they, just, they colors. Like, if everybody yeah. hurt. Exactly. Everybody, everybody bleed. Love. Like, you feel me? We, we all the same. Let me ask you a question. How did Kobe death? Cause I'm, I ain't gonna lie, I was a Kobe hater. Like I cheered for the guys <laughs> that was playing against Kobe. I'm not gonna even lie. Yeah. But when Kobe died, I cried just because, like, you know, that's our. We grew up. Yeah. Like. Yeah. You know, Kobe spent his, Kobe, whole, his yeah. whole life here. This goes back to it. Like this is a time we need to fucking unite. You know, you don't. I don't think he would have want that. You know, like, you know, we gotta make him proud. And and you know, this is. I don't know. I think. I think. You know. You do know. Yeah, I know, but you know. This for Kobe, man. You know, I'm paint this mural for Kobe. Um, you know, support. You know, I grew up watching Kobe, and um, yeah, this for Kobe, man.
nigga feel like Everybody ain't real like Johnny McKenzie If I could pretend, see, I wouldn't feel right I bought a Dodge Magnum, I just got signed Everybody on my line, they wanna know the taxes Do I got a mansion, 30k to my mom The hood turned up, bitches, bottles, dope and all that stuff Attention, high hopes to call my bluff Offended by the notes when I lost love Things change, people change, niggas change, bitches change Friend or foe, if it's so, pick a lane Lil Wayne on my single now Fucking hoes like I'm single now Triggers close to my fingers now But when the label froze up, they all chose up They telling me you're a non-believer now A felony all I could think about The cars got repoed, the bills they add up My bitch done left me, I smoked my last one I'm high with no sleep, I pray a back come I just might grab one, I just might blast one of you Cause I ain't got none to lose But I got these wins to gain And I don't feel comfortable One thing that I've learned all of these years Is to block devils off of my ears Fairy tales don't end well when the fame and fortune I hear everybody out of sight, out of mind, feeling like I'm running out of time, out of sight. Zine in a baby bottle, meditating on daily dollars Lately problems, stem from my bitch Cause she know I still fuck with my baby mama So they be drama, in the house I got to find the outlet Waiting on the plug just like a fucking outlet Fuck it, I'm turning my phone off Fantasies of grabbing the heat and burning my nose off Plow, the manic depressive that ain't been prescriptive What can he do? Anywho Boy, when you got it, you keep a close watch on the ones that's befriending you. you. Them'll be the ones that envy you. Envy you. Vividly dreaming about any you. you. But when you low, they don't tend to you. you. Acting new when they run into you. Into you. Fucking your bitch trying to feel like you. Feel like you. This the message I send to you. Look both ways before you cross me, I tell you. Look both ways before you cross me, I tell you. Look both ways before you cross me, I tell you. Look both ways, cause if you cross me, I kill you. It's not a matter of, of, um, of pushing beyond your limitations or expectations. It's really a matter of protecting your dreams, protecting your imagination. That's really the key. And when you do that, then the world just seems limitless.